15 Richest People in Nigeria in 2022 Nigeria is a large country with a strong presence on the African continent due to its size. Because of its historical achievements, well-known individuals, and global presence in almost every industry, it is one of the most well-known countries in the region. The fact that the vast majority of Nigeria's wealthiest men are also among the world's wealthiest Africans underlines the country's dominance. Despite the fact that many Nigerians are among the world's wealthiest Africans, wealth distribution in the country is unequal across the board. Individuals of distinction will be Nigeria's wealthiest in 2022. They own multi-billion dollar businesses and sit on the boards of several high-profile international corporations in Nigeria and elsewhere. Nigeria is endowed with both natural resources and intellectuals. The country has valiant men and women who have dedicated their lives to the constructive development of the country. Many billionaires, philanthropists, and business owners regard Nigeria as their motherland. This is a must-read for anyone who wants to become a millionaire. Learn about the differences between these men and women. They are successful today because they chose the right path. Despite the fact that some of them did not come from wealthy families, they have made significant contributions to future generations. Stay tuned as we learn more about Nigeria's richest people and their net worth. Please subscribe to Africa Reloaded as we begin the countdown. 15. Falarencho Alakaja The 15th on this list is a lady by name Falarencho Alakaja. Her money is spread throughout the fashion, real estate, oil and gas, and printing industries. She is the richest African businesswoman with a net worth of $1 billion. Her company, the Fantha Group, was founded in 1993. She works as a philanthropist for the Rose of Sharon Foundation, a women's empowerment organization. She funds many Nigerian students through the Falarencho Alakaja Scholarship Program, as well as other scholarship initiatives. 14. Orji Yuzokalu Orji Yuzokalu, the former governor of Abia State, is the CEO of Slock Holdings and has a net worth of $1.1 billion. His investments include furniture manufacturing, transportation, and the oil industry. He also owns the Daily Sun and the New Telegraph newspapers. He was expelled from the University of Mejiguri for his involvement in the Ali Musko riot. That was a watershed moment in his life and he never returned to school after that. He was able to obtain a loan and launch his own company. He began his career in the palm oil industry before moving on to furniture manufacturing and other ventures. His company, Slock Holdings, was founded a few years after his business meeting. Slock Holdings is now a global corporation with holdings in a variety of industries. 13. Abdul Salim Rabiu. Abdul Salim Rabiu is worth $1.1 billion. With investments in his company, the BUA Group, as well as real estate, he developed his business skills. The BUA Group is one of Nigeria's leading cement and sugar manufacturers. He is the owner of refineries in various parts of the country. His father, Khalifa Isiaku Rabiu, gave him the BUA Group company. His father was a hard worker. Even with that, he did not rest on the sores of the family business. He proceeded farther to make other changes and establishments in the company. Abdul Samad Rabiu has been a huge supporter of the country. He funded the development of the pediatric ward at Aminu Bayero University through the BUA Foundation. 12. Emmanuel Ojai Dr. Emmanuel Ojai the executive chairman slash managing director of Newell Ojai Holdings Limited was born in Lagos in 1951, received his primary and secondary education in Lagos, and completed his higher education at Isile Uku University. Emmanuel Ojai has a net worth of $1.2 billion as a result of his numerous investments in banking and automobile services. His company is called Ojai Holdings Limited. He is also the CEO of Newell Construction. He owns a number of businesses spread across the country. 11. ABC Orgiaco 
Ambrose Brian Chukwu Iloka, also known as ABC Orgiaco, started his business career as a medical doctor. Before entering the money market, he worked for a few years. He was a surgeon, but he was also interested in business. Before founding the Seplat Petroleum Industry, he attended Harvard Business School. He has a net worth of $1.2 billion. 10. Femi Ate Dolor. Femi Ate Dolor owns Zenon Petroleum and Gas Limited. He also serves as the chairman of Forte Oil PLC. He is the son of former Lagos State Governor Michiel Ate Dolor and the father of social media personalities Timmy and Florence, DJ Cuppy. His net worth is estimated to be $1.85 billion. Femi Atebola's investments extended beyond the oil and gas industry. He has interests in real estate management, shipping, and finance. His real estate holdings include properties in Nigeria, Dubai, London, and the United States. He is a visionary and philanthropist who contributes to various Nigerian scholarship programs. He is well known for his generosity to students at Michiel Atedolor University. 9. Eiko Senomi Eiko Senomi is a businessman who has retired. During his time in the military, he worked as a police officer. He is the owner of one of the country's largest conglomerates. He is the founder of Cosmos AG Oil the CEO of Talavras and many other companies. Through his multiple ventures in real estate, energy, mining, shipping, aviation, construction, and telecommunication, he amassed a net worth of $2.1 billion. 8. Andy Yuba Emmanuel Inamdi Yuba is a philanthropist and businessman who served as governor of Anambra State for only 14 days. He was appointed governor on May 27, 2007, but his appointment was overturned by the Supreme Court on June 14, 2007. Through his business ventures, he amassed a net worth of $2.1 billion. He is a Nigerian politician and former senator from Anambra State's Anambra South Senatorial District. 7. Emeka Offer Emeka Offer was once considered Nigeria's richest Igbo man. He began his career as a bitumen importer. He had been with the company for a long time and was familiar with a number of well-known corporations. He established Chrome Oil Services in 1985. He transformed the company into the Chrome Group in 1994. This category includes telecommunications and energy companies. His estimated net worth is $2.9 billion. 6. Benedict Peters Benedict Peters is a Nigerian business magnate with a stake in the oil and gas industry. He was formerly employed by Ondo PLC before joining Mrs. Oil Nigeria PLC. He was so enthusiastic about making changes that he decided to start his own petroleum company. Benedict Peters is currently the CEO of Adio Group, one of the country's largest petroleum companies. He has $3.3 billion in assets. 5. Cletus Ibedo The Ibedo Group's chief executive officer, Cletus Ibedo, is a hardworking entrepreneur who invests in a variety of sectors. His net worth is estimated to be about $3.8 billion. His hotels are well known throughout the United States. He works in real estate management cement manufacturing, oil and gas distribution, and even automobile parts. 4. Arthur Eze Arthur Eze is a royal dynasty prince from Anambra State's Akbar, Dunakofia LGA. He founded Atlas Oranto Petroleum. His net worth is estimated to be $5.8 billion. The vast majority of his holdings are in the oil and gas industry. His company is the largest privately held petroleum company in Nigeria. His companies are also present in Liberia, Guinea, and Gambia. He is both a politician and a chemical and mechanical engineer. 3. Alafea Kuriboy Igbo Alafea Kuriboy Igbo, sometimes known as oil money, is a business mogul and entrepreneur. In the entertainment industry, he is a trailblazer. 
He is the founder of Best Car Sales Limited and the owner of a British entrepreneur label. He is also the CEO of Trump's Music and Events. J-Boy is one of the musicians signed to his Oil Money Records label, which was founded in March 2021. He's also interested in the oil and gas industry, as well as real estate management. His net worth is currently $6.1 billion. 2. Mike Adeni Adenuga The second business magnet on the list is Mike Adenuga. His net worth is $6.3 billion, thanks to telecommunications businesses and investments. Adenuga was a hard worker from the beginning. He began working as a taxi driver to help pay for his tuition and other expenses. This was before he made his first million dealing lace materials and soft drinks at the age of 26. He began his career in the mining industry before moving on to communication services. His Globacom company is now Nigeria's second largest telecommunications corporation, as well as Kanoil. He was named the 22nd most influential person in Africa by the New Africans magazine in 2019. 1. Aliko Dangate Aliko Dangate is the first on the list. This business tycoon is worth $14.5 billion. According to Forbes, he is Africa's richest man and the world's 130th richest man. In 1977, his company, the Dangate Group, began as a tiny commercial organization. His company has managed to become Africa's biggest flour, sugar, and cement producer until this point. Nigeria, Benin Republic, Togo, Ghana, Ethiopia, Senegal, Cameroon, Tanzania, and Zambia are among the countries where the business entrepreneur has developed his industries. He specializes on commercializing indigenous and agricultural products in order to mine Nigeria's and Africa's wealth. His company has grown into a conglomerate that offers services such as import and export, brewery supplies, and other local items. The high rate of competition among the rich in Nigeria is one of the major reasons for the enormous gap between the rich and the poor. While the poor struggle to survive on a daily basis, the rich continue to try to milk them dry and increase their wealth. The good news is that some of these wealthy individuals have dedicated themselves to assisting the poor by creating jobs for thousands of unemployed people. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Subscribe to Africa Reloaded to receive more updates on our channel.